So we can get some nice flying. Headed back to get the cameras. And we're at Walton Hill. Mid slopes fly below as well, the main one. So from here I've been working the lift up and then in a few beats up to the top landing area on the mid slope. Stronger gust there. Do you want to up and into the airflow? That's We've got to pull that one down a wee bit so it doesn't catch the air. so it doesn't power up. Get into the shelter behind the gorse bush. Out of the way. No, it's just you always like this. The air scoops over the top. You used to do loads and loads of flying here. You can stand here with the wing all day long above you. On the ground you've got this real dead area. I so say that's why I was saying if you want me to lift up, if you look at the gorse bushes you'll see they're still moving. Yeah. But uh, there's a definite dead zone. scoop here plus the, the gorse ridge here right over the top. That's it, he's catching up and you get into the air there and then bounce it again. It's waiting for the recycles. And there's a wee timbo rock you can see just on the what appears to be the left, the right wing tip. Dimple rock on the skyline, usually bounce up to about there, then suddenly you're in clean air, nice slope to take off from, fly out and over this gorse ridge and then play about. Yeah, backtracking up to the rock. We'll be waiting until he just feels the right amount of lift up there. Because it has gone a bit more gusty down here, so you got lift, well, more lift and less lift. Set one surge.
see very little break, just little tiny touches as they're needed and a lot of harness control the steps now Alan's got his camera set up there so he's probably taking off past the camera and the sink there we go now the house lift is round by the front of the wood so if you're not getting enough lift to come straight over down here up into the lift near the treetops, carved round outside and then carved back obviously got enough lift just to play about with that area Slightly cross downwind, probably. Yep, get round and then carve round the front. And once you get lift and get above the treetops, you then really work it up. That's the standard house lift here. Thermal days it can be really good, but it'll work on any conditions when the wind's blowing up. You'd think the trees would filter the wind and actually reduce the lift, but you always get lift there if it's going to be anywhere. Carving back up to land fairly high up the slope and then either jogging up higher or taking off if there's lift to fly beats. Yep, it's pretty standard stuff. There's a couple of extra scoops. And you can sometimes just go up 20 30 feet, it gives you that bit more lift. Going up higher. Right, see so you soon. Got battery warning on online. on the rocks. So it's forecast to get a lot gustier as the day goes on. Obviously making the safety call to get down out there. Here a lot of the birds. Yeah, swinging the wing round together. The look of it. Getting a wave off. 